Hello everyone, welcome to video lecture series of Computer Organization and Architecture. Today's topic is Page Replacement Algorithm. In this video, I'll be talking about least recently used that is LRU algorithm. I will be telling you one numerical question. Let us begin. First, let me give you a brief about the least recently used algorithm LRU. See, from the name itself, it is clear least recently used means the thing or the number which is being used least in recent that will be replaced. So you have to be concerned that which digit or which data is not being used for the longest period of time that must be replaced. And LRU is the most widely used algorithm because it always provides less number of page faults in comparison to other methods. In the previous video, I have told about an example based on first in first out algorithm. So you can review that also. Now let us take an example. Here a reference string is being given and the number of frames in the memory is 3. Number of frames in the memory means you have to take 3 frames in one column means 3 rows you need to draw. So uh, I have uh, drawn a table but you can draw one by one column when you are like performing this calculation. So initially I have written whatever the string is being given in the question you can see. In each and every column, I have written one digit. And here, three frames, F1, F2, and this is F3. Three frames are there. So I have drawn three rows. And here, I'll be going to enter the data from F1. If I have been written F1 in place of F3, then I can enter the data from that also. So you can refer any one, but you, that must be same throughout the question. Now see, first digit is what? 5. So all the frames are empty. So 5 will be stored over here and this is the condition of miss. When 0 is coming, 5 is occupied over here at this place. 0 will be occupied over here. This is also the condition of miss. Third digit, 1. 0 is available here, 5 is already available, 1 will be stored over here. This is also the condition of miss. Now you can see all the three frames are occupied, which was initially empty. Now let us see 2. Next coming digit is what? 2. So when you have our next digit, then you have to see whether 2 is available in the earliest frame or not. 2 is not available. It means this is the condition of miss. There must be the replacement. But how this replacement happens? See, before this 2, 1 occur. Before 1, 0, it means 2 will be replaced by 5. Out of these, 5 is recently used. So 2 will be occupied over here. The here it will be 0 and it is 1. Next digit is 0. See, 0 is available over here at this particular place. It means this is the condition of hit. Same data, no replacement will occur. Next digit is what? 3. Now you see before 3, before 3, 0 is used. Before 0, 2 is used. 0 and 2, it means which is going to be replaced? 1 will be replaced. Means you have to identify which is the least used digit for the longest period. So 3 will be here. It is 0. This is 2. And this is the condition of miss. Next digit is 2. 2 is available in this particular frame. So this is the condition of hit. Nothing will be replaced. Next, 0. 0 is already available. It means this is the condition of hit. Hit means whenever the coming string, coming data is already available. Next, you can see 3. 3 is again available at this particular place means this is the condition of hit. This is 2, 0, 3. Next digit which is arriving that is 4. Now you can see 4 is not available over here means this is the condition of miss. But which digit is going to be replaced? Just observe before 4, 3 was used. Before 3, 0 was used. It means the replaced data would be 2. 4 will be here. This is 0 and this is 3. Now let us check for 1. Next digit is what? 1. And again, 1 is not available. It means this is the condition of miss. Check before 1, 4 is used. 3 is used means 
it will replace this 0. So this will be 3 as it is, this will be 4 as it is, right? 0 is being replaced. Next digit is 0. 0 you can see over here, 0 is not available means again this is the condition of mess and before 0, 1 was used. Before 1, 4, it means 0 will replace this 3. I hope now it must be clear how to replace the data. After this 5, 5 is again not available. It means the condition of mess. Now check before 5, 0 was available. Before 0, 1, it means 5 will replace this 4. This is 1, this is 0. Next digit is 0, 0 is available. It means the condition of hit, same data as it is, no replacement will occur. Next is 4, just identify before 4, 4 is not available, it means it is clear, this is the condition of miss. Before 4, least recently used was 0, then 5, it means 4 will replace this 1. You have to see the order. This is 0, this is 5, next is 3. 3 is also not available, means the condition of miss. Now, 3 will replace what? Before 3, just check 4. Before 4, 0, it means 3 will replace this 5. This is 4, this is 0. Next is 2. 2 is again not available, the condition of miss. Check before 2, 3 was used, before that 4 was used. It means 2 will replace this 0. This is 4, this is 3. Then next is what? 1. Again check before 1, 2 and 3 use, 2 and 3 use. So 1 will replace what? This 4. This is nothing but 2. This is 3 as it is and this is the condition of miss. Next digit is 2. Check 2 is available means this is the condition of hit. No replacement as it is you are going to write the data. Then 0. 0 is not available means this is the condition of miss. But 0 will replace what? Just check before 0, 2 and 1. It means 0 will replace this 3. Remaining as it is. Last is 1. You can see 1 is available means this is the condition of hit. No replacement occur as it is you are going to write the data. So I hope now this particular point is clear. You have to see. Upon arriving of which digit, you just check the earlier one and which is the least used in the recent that must be replaced. So you have to calculate here the number of page faults. Just check how many misses are there. Number of misses equal to the number of page uh, faults. This is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. 10, 11, 12, 13 and 14. So number of page faults is what? Number of page faults that is equal to in this particular case is 14. Number of page faults is that is equal to the number of miss. If you solve this particular question with the first in first out or optimal algorithm and with LRU you will find the number of page faults is the least in the case of the LRU algorithm. Thank you so much for watching this video.